standby queue. We're gonna go up the VIP experience queue because how many people get to do that? Which, by the way, if you go on the standby queue, you're just gonna come out right here after you go through one room and then you'll just meet up with the VIP experience people. But be on the right. This is a very fun and immersive queue. This is my third time walking through it. Feels like you're right inside the game, isn't that cool? So now we're walking into the outside of Super Nintendo World. Oh, someone's taking a selfie. Look at this, you can see Bowser. And you can get a peek of the whole Mushroom Kingdom. There's Bowser. It's a nice photo off. Bowser's challenging Mario to a race. So that's what we're gonna do. Gorgeous. Lots of fun little books in this room. fun is this? My favorite part in this room are these little coals up above. I like the bombs though too. where we learn how to play. It's a little different than the Mario Kart we remember. I'm gonna get some goggles to put on our head. They're actually pretty comfy. I always have a problem with these kinds of things not fitting on my head right, but um, there's a little twist in the back that allows you to adjust it 
pretty perfectly onto your head. All right, I can go into the next room. So here's the visor. Let's see if I can do this with one hand because I think it's pretty cool how it comes out. So you see it's like this, right? And then it flips. Isn't that cool? It flips. And then you tighten this knob to the right onto your head. Anyway, let's continue. I'm gonna go down the right side because now, tip, if you go down the left side and you get on the left side of the ride, when you exit the ride, you have to walk all the way around to get off the ride where, uh, to like walk around a building. If you go this way, you get right off the ride and enter the gift shop. If you enter the left, it's the long way around. <laughs> 